Mike Beaton here with Shanae Agumake of the Connecticut Sun and also a moonlighter for ESPN. I guess that's the best way of putting it. Uh, you've, I think you've talked about this all season, balancing both professional athlete and broadcasting. What have you learned about time management? Um, I have learned that it's possible. Uh, it's probably been one of the hardest things, you know, on your day off actually going up to work. But at the same time, it's so much fun. Like when you sit in the studio, um, I'm just falling in love with the game once again. So, you know, you play the game, you get to talk about it, it's win-win. Speaking of the game, what does it mean to be back here in the All-Star game after having to sit out last year? Yeah, I, it means the most to me. I mean, I did not even plan this. Um, I couldn't even expect it. Uh, I just wanted to come out and, and play at a high level. And to be named an All-Star, it just is crazy because for me, my expectations were just go out there, be whatever my team needs to be. So for me to be able to represent the Connecticut Sun, it's awesome. You've traveled a lot, of course, at Stanford with your broadcasting and you know, as a professional. So what do you make of the atmosphere here in Minnesota and what are you excited to to see it for Minnesota's first All-Star game? Well, watching my sis and playing so many, so many finals here in Minnesota, I know that the fans here are turned, they're ready to go. Um, so I'm excited for the game. I know it'll be really fun. I'm glad we have um, some mini teammates on both sides so that they won't be, you know, like a home court advantage for one. Um, but I'm excited because Minnesota has some of the best fans in the league. And who are you most excited to play alongside uh, tomorrow? I'm excited to play with everyone. I mean, I'm just excited because I wish my sister was here because I was number one. But other than that, like, there's so many talented players in this league. You finally get to suit up with them. So everybody, I'm happy to play with everyone. Well, this gives you some breaking rights, I guess, if you get put in a good game tomorrow. Absolutely. I mean, I think it's a little street cred. It's a little street cred. But um, I think we just want to give the fans a great game. That's priority number one. And then on your end, what have you enjoyed most about the broadcasting side of it and you know going to games and then uh, I saw your appearance on Get Up recently where your uh, companions were giving you a hard time uh, about the ejection and then uh, you turned it back on Mike Greenberg there. Yeah, I know. Well, you know, it's funny. I didn't even know I was going to get an ejection. I didn't even know the first technical even I don't happened. think you plan on for that in I a game. I didn't plan for that at all. Um, but yeah, I think it's funny. It's all it's all fair. Um, you know, this season has been really emotional. It's been a very short season, a lot of games, so it just happened. But I'm moving on, you know. Hopefully it won't happen again. All right. You want to say hi to anybody? Uh, hey, everybody. Chanel Gumake here, 1-3 for the Connecticut Sun. Root for Team Parker at the All-Star Game.